lines of my name is Symbiote Saiyan because I'm attracted to hairy dudes. Ooh. And like I like that whole furry Super Saiyan 4 gruff kind of thing. I think I now know why you invited me over. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, you had the facial hair of a yeah. Saiyan. Oh, I'm no, I'm hairy from my ears down. I'm just saying. It's from here down to my toes. It's it's like I'm a hobbit and a gorilla. And yet you've sex. got the whole Bruce Willis thing up top. Yeah, it's bald as a goddamn baby. Like Did you do that on baby. purpose or you just... No, I lost it all at the age of 18. It was, oh, uh, fuck. It was not by choice. All right, welcome back to Drinking Games. This is Symbiote Sand, and today with me, I've got a motherfucking Tom D. Tom Tom from. Le um, I almost said let's go with Plan C. I'm sorry, it was YouTube channel. Some assembly required. Um, let's go with Plan C was fucking the. Uh, a band that I used to work with when I was in like high school. Uh, they played along a couple shows alongside us. Um, well, why, why wasn't what? it? Let's let's go with Plan B. Like the pill, Plan B, kind of like you should have been. <laughs> okay, I don't know. <laughs> while we've known each other for a while, I don't know if you know how much my mother hates my existence. So she probably believes that she should like fucking swallow me. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, this is, um, I, my mother admitted she should have swallowed me. It wasn't even a question. <laughs> it's it's definitely. Why uh why was that not a question? Out of curiosity, you and your mom not talk? Oh no, we talk all the time. That's that's what makes it better. And I'm getting my <laughs> ass. Well, this is great. All right, here we go. Well, it's because you decided to fucking bring your little stick up against a dude with an actual sword. Like, do you Yo, realize? Well, that hey, whoa, hey, don't don't bash my stick, dude. You are the goddamn Donatello of this game. You might be smart, but you are fucking worthless otherwise if you just knew how accurate that was oh my god these are <laughs> all these buttons are different oh damn what did you just do to me it was a uh... mm. so you play a whole lot of dnd &D, right this, oh dnd &D for days this, this background's got me thinking dnd &D, and i need to know your absolute best dnd &D story holy gee okay you want to know okay so i have a best character and a best story oh but it's fucking either one Okay, so my best character is a guy named Balthazar. Also, fuck you. But go on. Um, <laughs> it's cool. It's everyone cool. can't see me flipping you off this one, but fuck him. Uh, he's funny. just playing free bird, guys. If you want to fuck Tommy Tom Tom, say so in the comments below. Whoa, hey, no, no, no. Just if you want to fuck Saiyan, say so in the comments below. I'm gonna get nothing but guys. Perfect. Yeah, no, there. dude, that's all it should be. Don't no, don't you do it. Don't I'm you trying fuck to it. ring out. Anyway, no, don't you ring me out, you motherfucker. No, no, fuck. Hold on. We, this is something way more. Damn it. <laughs> Talk to me about Balthazar. So Balthazar the Dragon Slayer was a drow that was actually underground for a very, very long time. They had, they were very limited You're on their book Dritz selection. You're a fan, aren't you? I'm actually not. That's really? the best part about this. It was because everyone that plays a yeah. drow, myself included, it got their start with Dritz. Forewarning, I, I'm not a big drow, uh, Dritz fan. So I'm going through, and I'm writing out the backstory. And the backstory of this is is the underground drow don't have a very large book collection. All right, so he gets the only books down there, which are two, of necromancy. And he thinks he knows everything there is to know about necromancy because he's gotten the two books that he needs from necromancy. So he goes off into the world to go show everybody his amazing skill at necromancy. He's horrible. All right. These two books don't do <laughs> shit. They're like intro 101. So we start this game off at like level fucking one. And we. Oh, what? Did your DM not give you? I always, because I, I always DM, I always give people a level boost of three or five. No, we just start. I like starting off at one. Most of my, most of my guys do. Uh, my, my DMs are in the same boat as me is because we like the character progression. Fair enough. I can appreciate that. Go on. So, yeah. So we're, like, going through. You're like, you think you could beat the motherfucking hero of time. I can't. Slick in, bitch. In, in fact, I'm just, I'm just over here just mashing buttons because I didn't even want to so try. I, dude. And so you, you, I. I don't want to fight. Like, if, if I beat Link, what am I going to do? I don't want to fight. I want to love. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, um, no, totally so fine. he's an awful necromancer. Oh, horrible on. necromancer. And so the whole story starts off in the beginning. The beginning mission we have to do is find a collection of books for this wizard. So, you know, it's a pretty simple mission. And one of the books Balthazar decides to open because he, you know, is curious. Uh, Lee can't out. swim! With, oh wait, yes, he can. Never mind. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was about to go, like, without the iron boots! And yeah. I'm like, wait, that throws you underwater. Exactly. Never mind. So, uh, okay, so yeah, so book. we're, we're going to read this. Like, so he reads this book about a fucking dragon. Well, lo and behold, it spawns a dragon. Well, the dragon, like, knocks him out, hit number uno. So he wasn't there for the entire fight. Well, he wakes up, and he's the only person there. 
So he is Balthazar the Dragon Slayer from so wait, that moment So wait, was it story-driven that you were supposed to be knocked out, or did you just happen to not die? I, no, I just happened to roll I just happen to roll a nat 1 on a ridiculous check, <laughs> and my DM happened to roll a nat 20. And so in 3.5, now we were playing it, is in that exact scenario, you were completely knocked out from the get-go. And everything you, you, know, you roll, you have negatives to. You just killed the fuck... Ganon is going to take over, you dumb bitch. No, nah, he's not going to take over. You got Yasuo, man. Oh, yes, yeah, because Yasuo <laughs> can wield the goddamn Master Sword, the Blade of Evil's Bane. My cock is yeah. going to be the Blade of your Bane. You, well, it's not the, my Bane. I enjoy your cock. That's why I'm here. The Bone of Shame. It's, anyway. the, bone of, it's the Bone of Redemption. <laughs> not when it's my bone. It, hey, me. it redempted me. Was just it saying. redempted I'm, you? I'm back. Yeah. I'm, I'm game. You mean redeemed? Redempted. No, nah, dude, I've had too much. We're in. Fair enough. We're in. Um, yeah, because, Yeah. so... Oh, sorry, go ahead. Uh, we do always talk about what we're drinking on the show, and Tom D. Tom Tom was dope enough to provide some Heritage Hills honey-flavored whiskey bourbon. Mm -hmm. um, we are actually sponsored today. Uh, I just want to throw this out. I don't know if you know this or not. We are sponsored uh, by ourselves, so we can do whatever the fuck we want. Sorry, continue. Oh, okay. I was going to be like, who the fuck are we sponsored? Like, <laughs> no, I, no, this is no, fucking news to me. We're sponsored by ourselves so that we can do whatever the fuck we want. Perfect. Go on. <laughs> So, uh, so yeah, so Balthazar, he's, oh, no, he, uh, so from that moment on, he was Balthazar the Dragon Slayer, because he woke up, and no one was there to correct him, so he thought he <laughs> slayed the dragon, and it was actually, it was actually my friend Harley's character, Tim, who was a cocaine-dealing wizard. Oh, my God, that's <laughs> And, so uh, yeah, he was a cocaine-dealing wizard who... He just kind of bitch-slapped him right there, just like... Yeah, it was, it was there. It's pretty much what happened. He's was, he was just like, shut the fuck down. <laughs> Bringing a nun shut to my motherfucking purple yeah. hair, giant ass, sword, we don't, G virus yeah. looking shit. We don't need no maxi pads going on here, okay? We're, we're just fine the way we are. No maxi pads. Yeah. Oh, I, oh, I see what you did there. I, I don't oh, that's the oldest there, maxi but... joke in the book. Come on. You can't tell me you didn't know about that maxi. No, I fucking used to play stop. This game with my dad. He never called maxi. This was his main, so no, he never called maxi. Of course, maxi of course a maxi main didn't call maxi maxi pad. <laughs> no. Maxi Maxi mains are not Maxi mains. Maxi mains are I just want to fuck you and you can't do anything. Um. So he was a dragon slayer. Yeah. So he he claimed himself as a as a dragon slayer and he went through epic levels where he actually turned into a god. By. Just telling people. Yeah, just telling people he was a dragon slayer. So and he, like, what he was his charisma? It. Oh, it was I like. I always build off the sharks charisma. It character. was yeah. It was actually it was it was fairly medium, but whenever he would like roll these, people would believe him because he had a, a very high like persuasion type like bluff. And so uh, Tim, of course, is like following around because he's in the same campaign as me, trying to tell people like, of course, I did not kill the dragon. No. Oh man. Damn you. Kick to the face. You're, You're a like, fucking huh. nightmare. Wow, wow, wow. Quick shout out, real fast. <laughs> um, so, whatever happened with this character, just out of curiosity? No, he became an epic level god. And he actually became the, the god of a lot of games <laughs> I ran. Because he, he, he lived. And it was by pure accident, mind you. Pure oh, accident, this guy lived. He should not have lived nearly as long as he did. It was just. Everything that happened was just 100%. It was just the luck of the die because he should have died countless times. I think at a point we had it racked up to where, <laughs> I yeah. Played, well, I haven't played because I usually DM, but I've seen characters played like that. It was like we had the count up to like 30 or something stupid like that at one point. I'm, you had to count up to 30. I was, yeah, that was tough. I mean, like. Were you like doing an extended boxing match? Like yeah. one, two, Jesus Christ. Essentially, every campaign he would do something stupid essentially to die. And the DM would just, it, it just wouldn't die. He would he would go out of his way to try to kill me and just wouldn't kill me. Oh, my God. Because he would just roll, like, now one of these. DM, oh, you no, to my triangle to button. Kill okay, it, was, it wasn't like, so it was a point where he got so Get sick of it. Get off the edge. No. Oh. I like, I like, being, I like <laughs> being up here with you. I like being up here with you, too. Thank you. I, I, by up here, I mean, like, the third floor, because that's where we're at on the apartment. Uh, I just, I just, yeah. no, I was, never yeah. mind. Uh. <laughs> 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 All right, I've never played Necrid to my knowledge. Let's try. I that. don't know what happened. I I figured it out. Okay, you're good. I figured it out. Fucking GameCube control, GameCube games back in the day, man. It was. <laughs> You'll never see a wireless controller have that issue. <laughs> <laughs> Sick burn. Sick. Shots <laughs> fired at <laughs> what was that? Fifth gen consoles. I don't I don't know what gen GameCube was, but. 
shots fired or anything before like five years ago. I don't know. I think we're underestimating PS. No, the PS3, Wii, and Xbox were 2007, bro. 11 years oh, ago. Don't remind me. Wireless controllers have been the norm for 11 years. You were the norm for 11 years. Oh, I've been the norm for way longer than 11 years. Wait, norm at what? I gotta make sure. My we're... spank bank? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. No. No. I've, I've definitely been the norm in your spank bank. Yeah. Okay. Years. As long as long as we're cool with that, like as long as we know. Um, <laughs> just so you guys. Yes, you're not gonna perfect me, Ivy. Oh fuck. What? Oh, my life. What? Oh, you shot. I thought you were gonna walk into me. Oh. <laughs> this is a fuck you, dick. Just, you know, just elbows up, elbows up, hands <laughs> up, walking <laughs> away. I slid into third base, motherfucker. You don't have to slide to get into third base with me. You can just ask, and I'd be like, take the walk. Are we not already at third base? No, I've got to give you your four balls. You got to take the walk. Can we? It, wait, wait. Can are we, we going baseball references, sexual innuendos, or? I mean, I feel, yeah. like, I, feel like, I feel like they both work. I feel like, hey, 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 no. That's <laughs> this is a fucking joke. I don't know what that was. Oh, my God. Stop stomping on his toes. He's not there, Ivy. Oh. No, stop it. I got to say, I think you would appreciate this. So, Because uh, <laughs> you, you you, and I were talking earlier. We, we apparently share the same favorite video game series of all time. That's Resident Evil. Resident um, Evil is is a top of my horror list, which, mind you, is very small. I am not a bitch. A, oh, Oh, that is an understatement. <laughs> All right, bitches have way more confidence than I do in video games. I squeal like, ooh, if you could, like, take a pig and just two octaves higher, bare minimum, and that that's why I said <laughs> if, it at If a you norm. would take that pig two octaves I, higher, have it fuck Michael Jackson, you make <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, on. no, that's about it. Yeah, you're right on par. I thought I was talking for a second. I was confused. <laughs> that was a perfect rendition of what I, I do. I heard myself in you saying <laughs> <laughs> Oh how accurate um, How accurate I didn't mean to do this I've I didn't mean to a, do uh, this Oh fuck it I'll take you on with 170 There we go Um oh look at that you go with the red that Goron tunic I'm going to be 100% honest I've never played Link in Soul Calibur You didn't have Soul Calibur for the GameCube did you Well I, I everybody did, played yeah. Link in Soul Calibur if you had for the GameCube it was motherfucking mm -hmm. Link in like 2004 yeah, I didn't play it on the GameCube. <laughs> what system did you play it for? Uh, I played it on PlayStation mostly. You had Hi Hachi from motherfucking Tekken. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's be honest. I this guess is a character that Link looks like he would normally fight in Zelda or something. Like what mini boss have we through a dungeon? Oh, fuck off. Yeah, I know. It's like. It's, it's, <laughs> it's what he should have looked like, let's be honest, okay? Hey, listen! I just kicked <laughs> your ass! Where? Um. Where is Navi? Tell me, tell me you're not Navi. That's no, I, no, Navi is not in this game to my knowledge. I'm about to say if if, if Navi is as is Azeroth, that's um. No, Navi actually burst from that little cavity in his chest you just saw. Oh, is that why Link's fighting fighting Azeroth? He's trying to. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I've got. <laughs> just watching the replay. I fucking lost it. Oh, that was um, pure gold. Oh, straight. You did a lot of work there, Link. Yeah, stretch it out, man. Stretch it out. Hey, man, you fucking I had did to it. Have that dodge. I, I mean, <laughs> oh no. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, oh, I've got a D and D story for you that I think oh, you would me. enjoy because you're a Resident Evil fan. Um, so the very first campaign I ever DM'd was based off Resident Evil, so the entire map was actually the layout of the mansion. But it was, obviously I changed it a bit, we're not just playing through Resident Evil as an RPG. Yeah. No, we changed it. Um, I think we got time for one more fight, by the way. Okay, um, okay. And at one point, do you remember the, 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 the dining room from the very beginning of the game? Mm-hmm. Um, so we had in our party, one of the characters was a goddamn treant who was racist against other types of wood. His name was Bogroot, so like if what? he saw oak trees, he would go into this, like, you know, he'd roll for it, get a berserker mode, or he was just this blind racist rage. He would break down doors that made of certain <laughs> woods. Uh, it was great. Like, if he saw oak, he would freak the fuck out. He was all like, some important oak trees, always with their big branches. Like, what it an was oakist. great. Huh? Yeah, what he, an oak is. Oh, yeah, he was, he was straight up an oak is. Why are we um, fucking playing fucking... Are we both the same chick? Oh, no, we're not. Sorry. No, no. Japanese bitches all look the same. I mean... Oh, <laughs> you did not just go there. No, I didn't go there. Look, what, the reason I say Japanese bitches all look the same, I don't know if they look the same. I just know that when I watch Japanese porn, they all sound the same. I need to turn the sound off. I know it's a rookie mistake. Um, 
oh, it's a rookie mistake. Then I've been the, I've been in the rookie league for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, so we're in that first area that's based off the main dining hall from the first Resident Evil, and of course, because it's a mansion, it has that real long table. So while two of the party members are fighting the first zombie they see, he's all like, "Hey." Want to roll to find out what that table is. You know, so he rolls nat fucking 20. So the best wood I can think of. I'm like, mahogany. And his, <laughs> his eyes, in like real life, the guy that's playing this character, Sterling Engine, you guys have heard him on the channel. His eyes light up like Christmas. He's like, I'm going to roll to fuck that table. <laughs> <laughs> he just fucked a table. So while they're battling the first zombie, he's just over there, locust tree in all his glory, fucking this long mahogany table. And um, he ends up snapping it in half, and they're all like, yeah, thanks for the help. But that was how that went down. So so he just fucked the table. Did he just, like, did he just climb on top of the table yeah, and start just, fucking it doggy fucking style? Yeah, he just fucking treant mounted that mahogany, you know, the table and just went to town. I'm impressed. Thrusting, and um, you can't, I mean, there was no risk of splinters because, well, it, it, the, the best part about it was it's considered necrophilia because that... That yeah. table is a dead tree. Oh, it's way dead. Um, yeah, it's way. Everybody's got their thing, man. On the note of necrophilia, that is all the time we have for today. Uh, so, um, just so you know, uh, again, Tom D. Tom Tom, go ahead, give a quick idea of what your channel does, what you're about. Okay, so we're some assembly required. We uh, we specialize in mostly VR gaming, but let me go ahead and just give you a rendition of real quick what our content is. Uh, go ahead and just look to your closest trash can and. Well, that's kind of what we do. We're just a bunch of trash. So if you're uh, interested in a bunch of trash gaming with a bunch of trash talking, feel free to come over and to some assembly. A bunch of trash people. Oh, just tr <laughs> just 100%. We are just the trashiest trash you can trash. I'm just saying. We we live in the Midwest, okay? We're all <laughs> trash. Just just trash. We're pure. Like, we're the best of the trash. <laughs> we make Detroit yeah. look like Glade candles. <laughs> Ooh. I never thought about it that way. But you're completely right. Yeah. Stay drunk, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Symbiote San. Thanks for enabling us destroying our livers. And if you want more fun hijinks, go ahead and click that subscribe button. That way you can catch up on all our videos as they come out. And if you haven't seen any of our older stuff, feel free to go ahead, go through our catalog, take a click. Maybe you'll find something you like. Stay drunk, everybody.